A possible government shutdown is becoming a greater threat as the U.S. House of Representatives unable to move forward with spending bills. And our Washington, D.C. correspondent Rachel Knapp joins us live from the U.S. Capitol. Rachel, what's next now for the House? Good evening, Mike. So we're all kind of wondering the same thing here on the Hill. Speaker McCarthy said, uh, told members that he could keep them next week working on these bills because the House really hasn't moved forward with any of these bills and they, these deadlines are just hanging over Congress. So on Wednesday, the House was planning on voting for a defense spending bill. It's typically one of the easiest appropriations bills for each chamber to agree on. But intraparty fighting among Republicans is growing in the House, keeping them from moving forward with not only that bill, but other necessary spending bills. Members in the House are ending their work for the week without a vote on any spending bill or a short-term funding bill this week. While over in the Senate, they are moving a mini package of three spending bills with large bipartisan support. So on top of the October 1st deadline to finalize these bills or else there will be a government shutdown, Speaker Kevin McCarthy is facing his own set of challenges. Some of the House far-right Republicans are issuing their own demands. Some are even embracing a shutdown. That's something Pennsylvania Congressman Mike Kelly tells me should not happen. I know some people talk about shutting down the government. I think it's the worst thing we can do in a world that's so unstable right now to be looking internally that we have that kind of division. We have to, we have to fund what we already spent. Uh, what we can do is make little adjustments that over a long period of time can begin to bring that down. But our debt is out of control right now. I think it's $33 trillion, which is totally unimaginable. Representative Kels, uh, Kelly tells me that he hopes that these Republican uh, colleagues of his who are pressuring the speaker to let the speaker kind of work in the sphere that he has and hoping again that there won't be a government shutdown.